African Biologics and the Universals Group have agreed to collaborate on the development of the first African-owned COVID-19 vaccine. The collaboration will focus on developing a new messenger ribonucleic acid vaccine that will leverage both companies' intellectual property as well as creating new IP and expanding access to the short. The companies will collaborate to address two major issues, a lack of domestic cost-efficient production and the need for cold or super-cold chains. According to both companies, this agreement is an important step towards ensuring that everyone everywhere in Africa and across low- and middle-income countries have access to life-saving vaccines and medicines. Now let's come to Ghana, where the Ghana Medical Association and the Ghana Registered Nurses and Midwives Association have expressed concern over vaccine hesitancy among health workers as COVID-19 cases surge across the country. We estimate that of about 200,000 health workforce in the public sector, nearly 80,000 representing 40% were yet to receive a second dose of vaccination, with less than 1% taking a booster jab. Now, the president of the Ghana Medical Association, GMA, Dr. Frank Sereboa, while speaking with a joint news conference, addressed hesitancy among healthcare workers and the general population to ramp up the country's COVID-19 vaccination rate. More so, the president of Ghana's Registered Nurses and Midwives Association, Mrs. Perpetual Ofori Ampofo, Encourage citizens to wear face masks at all times, especially in enclosed areas, imploring managers and organizers of uh, enclosed events to enforce the wearing of masks. 